sons or son. All right, because the Most High is not too terribly concerned with with you women. All right. <laughs> well, you're just, you're merely a tool for you're us. Just a tool for us. All right. As a matter of fact, where are your Lord? An example of that is a uh, uh, Sarah, which called Abraham her Lord. Abraham was also her husband. All right. Uh, Isaiah fifty four and thirteen, and all thy children shall be, or all thy sons shall be taught of the Lord, and great shall be the peace of thy sons. So we're, you're supposed to be taught of the Lord. All right, that's the proper like we spoke about the proper channels earlier. That's one of the proper channels. You you can't just form your own opinion about the heavenly Father. All right, you have to be taught, man. Okay. I got another comment. This is a good one. You're gonna like this one. Uh, this is from. Somebody named Bad News for You, Good News to Me. And this was two days ago. And uh, this is what it says. It says, does this retard sodomite Israelite know how long niggas tried to expose GMS and never succeeded? A drug dealer is worse than a pimp, you wizard. Mm. And, and how this nigga take the vow of a Nazarite, now listen to this good, mm. and only keep the vow of his hair which is a peace offering, then he quotes Numbers uh, 16 and 18. Read Numbers 16 and 18 again. You might want to read 22. Get that for me. 16 and 18. Read 16, eight, uh, 16 18, and 19, and 20. Got it? Uh, this is Numbers 6 and uh, 16. 18. Oh, 18. It says uh, Numbers 6 and 18. And the Nazarite shall shave the head of his separation at the door of the tabernacle of the congregation and shall take the hair of the head of his separation and put it in the fire which is under the sacrifice of the peace offerings. And the priest shall take the, verse 19, and the priest shall take the sodden shoulder of the ram and one unleavened cake out of the basket and one unleavened wafer and shall put them upon the hands of the Nazarite after the hair of his separation is shaven. Verse 20, and the priest shall wave them for a wave offering before the Lord. This is holy for the priest with uh, with the uh, wave breast and heave shoulder. And after that, the Nazarite may drink wine. So even this guy got understanding, way more understanding than you. Somebody speak. I'm looking for more comments. Yeah, yeah go ahead. Well, I uh, you still got that Proverbs. Yeah, um, but basically all you guys are coming against us, talking all your shit, but like myself, Apostle Kabar just said, when the Most High start killing you guys, and you know we say that and y'all don't take it serious, but when it starts happening, it's going to happen out of nowhere, man. When the rains are coming, the floods are going to come, the winds Yep. Yeah yeah, 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 the rains are coming, the floods are going to come, the winds are going to blow, the tribulation, the time of trouble that we've been telling you about, Jacob, uh, Jacob's time of trouble, that's coming, man. And that's what's going to separate the, the bullshit artists from the ones who are real, from the ones who are really uh, into these uh, uh, scriptures. Now we're going to read this scripture right here. Uh, quote it and read it, brother. Proverbs 1, uh, verse 22. How long, ye simple ones, will ye love simplicity, and the scorners delight in their scorning, and fools hate knowledge? The reason you guys got a problem with our doctrine, so to speak, and it's not our doctrine. It's Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai's doctrine. We're just bringing it out, man. Okay? We're just the messengers, man. They're the old saying, don't shoot the messenger, man. But y'all doing that. Y'all y'all blasting rockets at us, man. But it's okay. Yahweh Shai said this. He said, uh, know this, that if the world hated me before it hated you, it will hate you. So y'all hate us because it's the spirit of Yahweh Shai must be working with us, man. Fools hate knowledge. That's why y'all got a problem with the rape thing. Okay? You want me to just carry on down? Yeah, yes, sir. Yeah, so um, verse 23. Turn you at my reproof. Behold, I will pour out my spirit unto you. Turn ye at my reproof. The Lord is doing it. The Lord is reproving all of y'all because we're bringing out the scriptures the right way. We're telling you the market of pieces, the chip, and all the other things that we teach, and the rape thing is one amongst them, man. That's a fact. That's in the scriptures. Now, once again, you damn retards, we ain't telling nobody to go out and rape no nobody. 12-year-old girl, a 60-year-old woman. You don't rape no, because what's going to happen? The white man going to lock you up, man. 
Tummy, right? You, 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 you can't practice that right now. But in the kingdom, first of all, Apostle Taha said this a few weeks back. We ain't going to be raping nobody. We ain't going to have to rape no women, man. Yeah. We ain't gonna, so we ain't going to be raping no women because they're going to be willingly coming to us, man. Even before the kingdom. Well, uh, yeah, um, yeah, even before the kingdom. Isaiah, the fourth chapter, the first verse proves that. All right? Because when the Lord give his men power, one of the things that draw women to men is power. You know? Yeah, man. So we ain't going to be raping nobody. We ain't going to have to, man. We're going to be in our king. Like the apostles just said, we before the the, the kingdom, man. Because when shit start popping off, that's Isaiah uh, 4 and 1, man. Yep. When shit start popping off out here, the bullshit artists, all, the, the, the Alize passion fruits, and all you bozos. Yeah, you're going to be destroyed. Yep. I'm going to repeat that. You are the circle of GMS. You're not a man of the Lord, and you're going to be destroyed. Well, like I said, my man, you 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 um you got a raw deal from the jump, man. Looking at your old man, right? I will make known my words unto you. The Most High is doing that by us bringing out these scriptures and what y'all doing, y'all the scorners, the lightning, they're scorning, y'all scorning what we saying, man. His words, verse twenty four, because I have called and ye refused. Uh, well, uh, the Most High. Every time you watch a GMS video. And we bring out the scriptures the right way, and y'all have a problem with it. That's the most. The Most High is calling because the Most High is fair, man. He's fair. He's a fair power. He's a just power, man. He ain't gonna just destroy you. And then we brought out the scripture in Ezekiel about the watchmen. Yeah, yeah. When we went to uh, when we went to uh, uh, saw, saw niggas channel when he brought us on, that was the Most High using us to call you niggas that's into that black. Egyptology bullshit. That was the Heavenly Father calling. And he was using us. So just like the scriptures say, because I have called and ye refused, and we saw what happened. Many of those individuals that's in that black unconsciousness shit, they refused. Yeah. All right? They refused. And they refused, and you other bootleggers were like camps. Y'all refuse. You guys, General Johanna and Nate. Oh, this the thing with the name of the Lord. In other words, we teach and we telling you the name of the Lord. The name of Yahweh Shai and the Most High, we tell all that, man, the right way. We're giving y'all the scriptures the right way. So that's the Most High calling. But what do you guys do? Y'all come against this, man. You refuse, like Baloo. Baloo, he's, he's seen us. He got emotional. He got offended, a feminine, right? And instead, Baloo refused. refused. Because we told that nigga the right way. We said, look, man. And, all, and the whole thing with Baloo, we just told the brother, look, man, you got to be going out in the winter. You got to go out year round. He flipped that. He refused. It wasn't us. That was the spirit. You weren't spiritual enough. But you had, you know, but Baloo had other men with him. Them guys ain't going out either, man. They ain't going they out either. They're going to destroy them, yeah. including um, uh, uh, Tara. Yeah. The guy, most high going to get you. He's been in, in this truth for 20 yeah. plus years. Yeah. He ain't a camp leader. He don't go out speaking. When it gets warm, you see his black yeah, ass yeah, out yeah, there. Yep, yep, cunt. With that Tim. Yep. He had a few guys. You're right. Blue had a whole camp. He had a whole camp. At when one it gets point. Uh, about another about another another seven eight weeks, watch how many guys come out. Yep, they gonna come out. Check check all the check check out the video. <laughs> like my, like uh, that bitch Yashawan. Remember the the so called Jew bitch. Oh yeah yeah yeah. yeah said, check out the video. Yeah. Check out the video. Yeah. Check out the videos. Yeah. See see what guys are out here.